Hey guys, all right, so this is week 35 and I, um, I lost weight again and I, um, uh, let's see, I'm down to 167.4 and that's uh, minus 1.6 from last week. So I'm losing pretty consistently. I am no longer losing about two pounds a week, but I'm working pretty hard at it and I'm losing one and a half pounds. So, but on average, one and a half pounds, I think that's pretty damn good, especially at this point in my weight loss. And, um, but yeah, I mean, I'm pretty damn close to the first goal that I set out for myself that I wanted to look like I did or get down almost to the weight I did before. And my last losing weight journey that I stupidly gained all the way back, um, I had got down to 165 right before my wedding and I thought, and I looked amazing and I felt amazing. And that's been like my first goal, so I've basically hit that. Um, I ran out of clothes, you know, I, I think I was talking about that before. I, I keep running out of clothes, like I have nothing to wear. And I, um, I, my husband was really nice. He's like, oh, I'm going to take you clothes shopping because he's, he's tired of me tugging up my pants or I'm coming up with things like, let me wear a rubber band on this or uh, I got my belt like, it's totally tightened and I don't even know I have to make more holes so anyway um but that's a good thing so I I only will go shopping at Goodwill right now because I mean I won't I don't want them to get me anything else right now only from Goodwill because it's stupid I'm dropping sizes like crazy so that way when they get too big I just bring them back to Goodwill it's kind of recycling and uh but you get name brands there like there's a really nice one around and um so anyway, I got, well, this is one of the tops. Like I will always like, I will search the racks for nothing but name brands. I mean, I'm, I'm usually pretty lucky. And so I got like five Aeropostale shirts. Um, my one jeans that I just, they're like way too big. I have to stop wearing them. They're baby pets. And um, you can get totally name brands and nice stuff, you know. Anyway, so these are size 11 juniors and they fit me really good like they, they're not even too tight um they, they fit me perfect on the, the waist you know they fit kind of right here at the, the hippie i guess that's pretty much my hip yeah um so i like how they fit me and they fit me good in the butt they could actually they're not even that tight i mean yeah and this is size 11 juniors i actually tried on size 10s oh and then okay i don't I haven't been showing off my body like the whole time, but so as you can see, like um, it is totally going down. That's totally going down. And um, then the front view, uh, um, you know, I got this right there, but um, like if, <laughs> okay, this is what I was showing my husband. I was like, look, if I do this, it's like almost perfect. <laughs> so that means I just need to, um, I need to lose just a little more. In fact, I've decided I've always thought, oh my God, I hate these stretch marks. But you know what? I don't. Um, I just want my stomach to be super toned and like I earn these damn stretch marks. So I'd be like, hell yeah, I had three kids. Check out my stretch marks. <laughs> but anyway, so in and this one pouch thing, I'm not showing it because I'm not showing my underwear on camera. Um, but this one pouch thing, you know, it's like from having babies and um, your stomach's getting stretched out too much, whatever, then, uh, and it's always been like really a bad pet peeve of mine. It's kind of like, you know, I don't know. But anyways, it is like barely there, seriously. It is shrinking slowly but surely. So I'm so super happy about that. So enough about my body, okay. Um, but those are super improvements completely. Um, I've lost inches in different places, so it's going down. And, you know, not bad for just turning 37 and, and being the mom of a 21, 18, and 14-year-old. So, uh, I'm doing this. Uh, yeah. So, anyway, um, for my birthday, I got a $20 gift card. And, look, I got new shoes. They're pink. Aren't they pretty? Uh, there's some brand I never heard of. I'm like, a, like, I love Skechers. I used to always only wear Nikes. And I don't have Nikes right now because I had finally thrown them away. I only had these Fila's and I don't like them. My husband got them for me, but I keep trying to tell him, like, I don't like Fila's. <laughs> I just don't like them. 
Um, I just like only Nikes or Skechers, but, and, you know, um, I've never had, okay, this is going to sound bad, but I've never owned a generic shoe in my life. <laughs> but, um, and I had the $20 gift card to Walmart, and I was like, uh, it was really cool that I got it. So, I'm like, you know what, I need new running shoes, and right now, we just, I'm not working, so I we cannot afford to splurge on the shoes right now, even though there's super good sales going on. Um, just not right now. And anyway, so my husband did he wanted me to wait to get the good shoes, but I'm like, no, I'm gonna use my gift card and get these. And I really like them, they're light and airy. I just I'm surprised how good they are. So I might get some more pairs of those in different colors because I like bright colors. And um <sighs> Pretty much I do the same thing. Uh, this is, I know it's TMI, but I've talked about PMS, ovulation, blah, 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 blah. Well, this is PMS week again. And um, what I'm doing different than what I did last time, uh, last month, uh, I was feeling blah, I'm tired and crampy and this and this and that. And so I was like, yeah, I'm so tired. I don't feel like exercising. I am doing it no matter what. Um, I still don't. Feel like it. God, I'm, I'm lazy technically, but um, every day I go out walking. I walk at least five miles because I, where I walk is like two and a half miles all the way down and it's two and a half miles to come back. And then, um, so I do my five mile walk and then, which takes me about an hour, let's see. Yeah, it's taking me about an hour and a half now. So I'm getting faster at that. And it's hot as hell out, so <laughs> getting some day too. And so I'll do that in about an hour and a half. And then I get in at least a 30 minutes, I get 30 minutes elapsed in the pool. And then depending on if somebody's out there uh, and I'm talking to them or the water just feels too damn good to get out of it, then I'll do, um, you know, like 30 more minutes or whatever floating around I call it like I'm just doing my tea bag stuff like flow like a tea bag because I'm just basically yeah okay blah blah blah, blah talking to people and and but floating around but like I'll do serious laps and you know in the back rooms whatever so I'm trying to get a good workout and I feel it and a lot of times um I'll do a lap back and forth now we have a big pool um it's it's a decent size for sure and um, so I'll go back and forth and back and forth again. And then I'll go up to the, the end and I'll lift up myself like 10, 15 times in the front. And then I'll go to the other, I'll swim down to the other side and then I'll do it from the back like dips, you know. So I try to make like extra workouts while I'm at it and tighten in my abs. Anyway, so I, I do work it for 30 minutes. And then, um, and then I might socialize longer. And then... Uh, after dinner, I go for a walk too. Not always, especially on the weekends. Or some, well, okay, yeah, I have been. I've only skipped it a couple times going after dinner. Only because my husband is all like, oh, no, no, don't go with me. Here. Don't don't leave me. Come sit here, you know. And, and, like, you know, he says he wants to spend time with me. And then he's all like, oh, be quiet. Ugh. You know, um whatever you know men he wants to veg out and he wants his wife right here but i'm like well how about i just go but anyway um so so that's basically what i've been doing i've been doing that every day and i think stepping up my exercise not only am i not getting any symptoms of pms so far not good, um and i feel better and i feel more or, um energized and and happier we haven't been fighting um like the you know exercise reduces stress and all kinds of stuff so it's really working for me and also i am trying to um limit the fiber and of course drink a lot of water and that type of thing um kind of watch the carbs i don't really have a lot of carbs anyway but um, so just keep it that way. I just have like, you know, whole, whole wheat and so like that. And then, um, not eat sodium stuff, which I don't either. I'm sure there's sodium in stuff, but I, 
I'm not eating like, I don't know, whatever has lots of sodium, nachos, <laughs> something. I don't, I don't do that. So, um, yeah. Anyway, what I'm doing is working and uh, I'm going to keep doing it. So, I think I have, well, I already know my goal on the scale is I want to be like 135. Um, but I think I finally have a pants size goal. You know, because you're supposed to like try to visualize type of thing. And um, I think I want to be like a 5'6". Hopefully that wouldn't be too skinny. We'll see when we get there because I don't want to be too skinny. I want to look like healthy and fit, you know. And I totally don't want to look my age. <laughs> so, um, so far, mission accomplished on that one. Alright, so... Um, you guys have a wonderful week. Remember, I'm on My Fitness Pal. I have um, a Facebook page that um, I have a public one, and I have my own, and I'm part of uh, groups and everything. So if you want to find me, message me on here or whatever. And um, um, for now, you have my support, and thanks for watching. If you did, if not, I guess this would just be my personal chronicle. <laughs> All right, bye, guys. I just got a phone call from a place I have been dying to work at. Like, it is excellent. The owner is cool. The whole establishment is. It is constantly busy throughout the year. It's not just seasonal. And um, they called me. I didn't even put the application in. So I have an interview today. So hopefully I will be back to work because I've always done customer service. I've always done bartending, serving ever since I was 14. And that is really all I want to do, honestly. Even all this time, I mean, I've got 64 college credits. And um, honestly, a lot of times, it, like, um, well, when I was at the casino, I could be making way more than what I was going for, you know, for college. So um, it's really, it's really all I want to do. And um, I know that. If I get this job, not only will our money issues be better, that uh, um, I can stay active constantly more, and also uh, um, I'll finally feel better doing it because, yay, I have lost the weight. So uh, it'll make it a lot better to get a job. I am sorry, but it is very true how I've been discriminated against this whole time before I've lost the weight. I know I've got more to go, but I'm down to average. <laughs> Yay, I'd rather be average. So, um, yeah, so I will give update if I, how the interview went afterwards. I'll even do another video. All right, wish, cross your fingers for me. It's at 3.30 today.